Hello friends and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. My name is Mandy and I like to talk about makeup panning, nail polish, and things happening in my real life. Today I have my update for the Love My Makeup project, so stay tuned. All right, this is a project that I created called Love My Makeup Project, or Love My Makeup. Uh, it is a simple project that I created to fill a gap in my schedule, and it is a 10-use product, 10-use project for three products. This project is open to anybody who wishes to join. Like I said, it is three products that you use 10 times, no rush. Take as long as you want. There is no end date. And um, you can update anytime you want as long as you update. And it doesn't have to be every month. It can be every other month. And you can take as long as you want. Some of these products I have in have been in since September. So, um, yeah, we're going to see how we do. So I am working on three products. I have one for my eyes, one for my face and one for my lips. And that is how I choose to do it. You don't have to do it. You can choose any three products you want. Something for your hair, something for your skin, something for your face, whatever uh, you want. Just three products to use 10 times. It's that easy. So I am working on the first one is for my eyes and I decided to bring in an eyeliner. I am working on this one here. This is from Lottie London. It is their AM to PM eyeliner in the shade Velvet. It is a super dark, uh, I mean super, super deep, almost blackened purple. That is what it looks like. It looks, it's basically, it's black. It's basically, it's black. Um, the only time I can tell that it is purple is if like there is a direct light shining on it. And um, yeah, my, um, so far I have used this seven times. So I have three more uses to go. Um, I have three more uses to go. I thought about bringing in another eyeliner or another eye product to replace it, but I'm just going to keep working on this for the next month. And um, if I finish it, I finish it. If I don't, I don't. I'm not going to give myself pressure because, you know, bringing something in before I finish something just means I have one more thing to work on. And I don't need that kind of pressure in my life. This is a low pressure project. The next product I had in I did make my goal on, it is for my lips category, and it is a lip liner, and this is from Beauty For Real, that is their Define Lip Liner in Neutral Deep, and this is sort of a dark burgundy brown. There is a swatch of it there, and I did use this the remaining times, so I used it 10 times, because that's the goal of this project. So I will be bringing something in to replace that. And then finally, last month I brought in both of those liners I brought in in September. And then last month I brought in something for my face and that is going to be my blush. And this is the Sephora blush in shade 01 Shame on You. And that is what it looks like. I am wearing it today over a cream other cream blush. Um, I probably could have gone with the darker shade, but I'm still trying to figure out how to find the, the right shade of blush that I'm looking for. But there is what it's swatched like. It is light. It is bright. It is peachy. I was going for pink, but this is not it. But it's closer to some of my other ones. So, um, so far I have used it three times, including today. So I have seven more uses to go. So that one's going to be sticking around for a while. So since I rolled out my lip liner from Beauty For Real, I am bringing in a new lip product. And this is one I have not tried. So I want to use this project to find out if I like it, if I can make it work for me. And if it's something I want to keep, it is from Jeffree Star. And it is the shade Paleontologist. And is there any kind of, I can't read any of that. It looks like it's a matte formula. Um, and this is what it looks like. It is a very neutral shade. 
So I'll give you a swatch of it. It is a very neutral beigey shade. I don't know. Those are not my kind of preferred colors, but I may be able to mix it with a lip liner and it may turn out looking quite nice. Or I might try using it as a cream blush. Um, looks very kind of similar to that one, a little bit darker. We'll see. Maybe I'll, I can use this as a cream blush. Um, but it, it's definitely not what I would prefer. But then again, I don't think I've ever worn this color on my lips or a color like this because I tend to go for either the dark burgundies or a cooler mauvey pink. So we'll see. I, I will give this a try and uh, let you know what I think and use it the 10 times to see if I'm going to keep it and if I am, how I can make it work for me. So that is everything for this video. It's quick, it's short, it's simple. If you want to join, please let me know. You can just leave it down in the comments and use the hashtag LoveMyMakeupProject so that I can um, find your videos. Until my next video, take care of yourselves. Stay true to you, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.